Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's get straight to it. In today's video you will find out how the price of IOTA has changed and what the technical indicators EMA, RSI and stochastic RSI are showing. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. Looking at the hourly time frame for IOTA, the price rapidly went down with around 5.1% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 1.35. On the other hand, this move wasn't very strong because the volume wasn't very high. Jumping to the hourly exponential moving averages, the price at the moment is, is situated below the hourly ribbon, which is usually bearish and the ribbon can act as a resistance, so you should keep an eye on if the price will break it or bounce of it. The current price to watch is around 1.41. The ribbon is relatively spread out so the resistance should be considered. Looking at the hourly relative strength index, the current hourly RSI is at 35, so there are currently no signs of the crypto being overbought or oversold. Moving to the hourly stochastic RSI, there are no signs of the stochastic RSI being oversold or overbought at this time, but we can see that the trend is currently going down because the K line is below the D line. Looking at the three hourly exponential moving averages, the current price went below the three hourly ribbon, so you should see if the price can jump back above the ribbon or it will play as a resistance to the upside currently at around 1.4. Looking at the three hourly relative strength index, the current three hourly RSI is at 37, so it doesn't show signs of overbought or oversold conditions at this point. Looking at the three hourly stochastic RSI, both the percent %K and percent %D lines are in the lower region, which means that the price is getting oversold and soon a trend change or at least some kind of consolidation could be expected. You should wait to see if there will be an upward trend to the crypto because the K line has not yet crossed the D line. Generally, the bigger time frames have a bigger impact on the price, so please keep that in mind when we show different time frames showing contrasting indicators. Also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time. time.